Hi, this is Carrie, a resident UK 14 mid-sized queen and big sis on the internet. I am on a mission to live my very best life. And I understand that my best life isn't always going to be the most remarkable, highlight reel kind of things like going on a crazy holiday. Some days feel kind of regular, kind of mundane, nothing much to shout about. Like for example, going to the bakery with my best friend who I've known since I was 14. So I'm starting to document a lot of these moments and I'm flipping the script a little bit with these vlogs. How would 8 year old Carrie feel if she could watch herself eating all of the bread she liked and even getting seconds and thirds? from this cozy, fancy Japanese bakery. And just by changing my perspective, I finally see that these moments are totally worth documenting. Okay, to be fair, I've only had Mentago bread at like two places in Singapore, but this is the better one. <laughs> and I'm eating this prawn katsu thing, which is also pretty nice. I mean, my standard is four leaves, so... <laughs> this is good enough. This is great. This is way more than four It's great. Hera let me try her mentaiko bread. And from the way she described it, I thought that it was like, oh, normal, you know, quite nice, you know what I mean. And then I ate it. And it was like, oh my god, it's so nice. Maybe her usual reaction is like, mm, nice. That, this time she's like, mm, not bad, you know. But for me, it's like, wow, this is damn nice. It's so flavorful. I'm gonna buy one now. Wow! Look at the texture. Now nah, have some. Oh, have you? The curry bun has vegetables inside. So that means it's a real Japanese, Japanese curry. curry in the bun. It's not the. Oh, let's just put the paste in there and then. Oh, it's like real full blown Japanese curry with the beef, with the onions, the carrots. Everything is inside. เดี๋ยวนี้ก็ไปกันกินอีกรสชาติกับเบรดทูอืมเป็นรสชาติจังเลยเบรดพาสต้าอืมโอเคพาสต้าอีกไคนัสบีอีกรสชาติบัตเน
We're at Boon Tongki now with my husband because he want to eat chicken rice. I'm too full, I eat too much bread. And we're just waiting to see how much the bill is. So one kangkong, two rice, one chicken for two people, 40, 70. So we're done with dinner. Now we're going to get Freeman's watch. We're heading back to the car and we're going to Marina Bay Sands where we have to pay for a very expensive car park. So now we're off to find a coffee because my husband is tired. Can you Instead of Marina mm. Bay Sands. Can you not post this? No, I will post it. Be that one. Be in the camera. Go. Get a toy for it. to get a car park lot. Welcome to Marina Pay Sands. Where you pay and pay. Marina Pay Sands. Pay until you no more sand. One sand also don't have. Hey, okay. How much is the car park here? 14. Uh, more expensive. More expensive than Takashima. If we can't retain the tier, we have to pay $14 for this freaking car park. How long was that? How long was that? 10 minutes? 10 minutes for the car park. Okay, we found it. We found Panerai. Freeman bought a new watch strap because his old watch strap is moldy. And then now he has lost his buckle, so he has to spend more money to buy another buckle. Baller! Okay, this is his Panerai. And basically, he bought like a replacement strap. And this comes with an indicator buckle. Now he's bought a strap like this, and he doesn't have the buckle. So now he's buying a buckle. This is a $390 buckle. And this is a $500 strap. He has a new watch. <laughs>
Well, I kind of got inspired to document my life a little bit, so I've decided to do vlogs again. I haven't been doing this in years, and I've been doing a lot of Instagram reels and like quick quick things like that, videos that are more short form and more informative, but not something like this. I'm kind of looking forward to like watching these videos in a couple of years and like time capsule stuff. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this vlog hanging out with me. Yeah, so see you at the next vlog. Bye.